I managed to get the maps, the thing that we came to this godforsaken place for. The thing that may give us a new goal and a hope for the future. After the dark, claustrophobic bunker, the vastness of desert seems to embody freedom. I must deliver the maps to the Aurora, but I don't think anyone will mind if I take a few detours along the way. This desert seems to hold many secrets worth uncovering. Inside! A fool! Arvion, I have the mirror on the line here, so take his seat and be with you soon. What a storm! It made of sand, no less! But damn the sand! Alright, Miller, over and out. You got them? Great job, Artyom! Great news! Artyom got the maps! Well done, Wait. Artyom! That is such a relief. Idiot! Get started with these. I'll join you later. Here. There's a lot of data. The sooner we analyze it, the better. We have the maps. Now we have to find a way out of this place. And that's the hard part. We need water for the Aurora and the crew, as you can see. Stepan, Duke, and Alyosha are done with dehydration already. We also need fuel. The local bandits have it all. I had already contacted their so-called Baron, but his terms proved to be... unacceptable. He'll told us where they get the water, but naturally, the well is guarded. The mirror recounted the place, and says we could infiltrate it stealthily. So, Artyom, when you're ready, go rendezvous with the mirror. Your goal is to bring water to the Aurora. Failure is not an option. Good luck, Artyom. I... We are all counting on you. Crest, how's the weather? The storm seems Grand to be over. Fayera. I'll go back to the post. Don't you have any water left at all? Perfect. Well, well, where would I keep any? Artyom, come here. Uncle Artyom, is this for me? Wow, thank you. Look, Grandpa Yermak, I have my own canteen now. Well, now we'll have to ask for some water. Then you'll have your own untouchable... Artyom, while you were out, I finished making one wow, more thing for the Tihar. Thank you. The workbench is at your service. Mom, Uncle Artyom just gave me a canteen. What have you got, idiot? What can I say? We clearly didn't come here in vain. Got it all figured out? Sure seems so. The radiation levels are plotted in color. <laughs> they even have the radiation level dynamics here. When is it from? Hmm. Yeah, a bit old. Well, let's hope the situation didn't deteriorate since then. Which maps have we got? Central Asia, Western Siberia, the Urals, the European part of the country. Aha, I see. Yeah. No Far East. Uh, so, We're... did you try the new ammo out? Should work great with all this oil around. I figure the Holy Flame would be pretty happy with them. Hmm? <laughs> Artyom, thanks for coming by to see the guys.
up everyone, the Baron is speaking. We are going to have a grown-up conversation here, gentlemen. So move your drivers away from the radios. Done? Good. It has come to my attention that Shell Game told people that I should not have burned Sweaty. And that Sweaty was an okay guy. And I overreacted on the stupid Shell Game intended for the driver. Who cares if he got drunk within the slave side? and took a leak into the holy flame. Well, I have just put Shell Game down. Nothing could be done about that. Those of you who he owed can get remuneration from his wife. <laughs> She's worth it. So, to avoid further incidents like this, I gotta tell you people something here. Especially the new one. Tell me, why do the tribals obey us? Is it because they fear us? It's partly but fear before man is not absolute. When your life is so shitty you've got nothing to lose, you start having rebellious thoughts, even if you are the lowest of the tribes. And can we have that, gentlemen? No. We cannot have that. That is exactly why tribes must have faith. Faith in the supreme force, making the world what it is, making a master a master. And a slave? Not the man with the gun. The dead. The universe itself has created this world order and God. Power that is your
Nah, there's nobody around. Who'd even go here and what for? Any tribal? Hey, where did you go? <laughs> Come on, bro! Goya! even go here and what for? Would any tribals help their own? <laughs> hey, where did you go? Sometimes I wish you could talk. You're a good friend. I guess the best I ever had. Yes, you're a good boy, you are. Oh, why do I... Come the fuck down already! You've nowhere else to go! Don't drag, we won't hurt you. The Baron has extended you an offer you can't really afford to decline. Capay. Hmm? No, 
much, very much. Go to hell. Guy. Up there! Can you see him? He's hiding somewhere, and I want him found ASAP! Get to it! Men down! You better surrender now! Where? Where? Are you? Where? He's hiding somewhere, so flush him out, people! Let's not prolong the Look, up there! Did you see it too? Saying it's crawling with freaks. 
How long has it been since I told you to clear it out and collect all the usable stuff? So just for a second, just show yourself! There's a whole bunch of good gear going to waste. The boys are losing... You better come, come out now! Story. And don't give a shit that you were put in charge of the place. You short that hand, you can't handle this... Where the hell is this bastard? Just tell me so. But if you think you can do it, reduce the result. Otherwise, it might be taken I see him! <laughs> hey! Down there! Reload, people! Don't shoot! I, I laid down my weapons already!
Are you ready? How are the guys doing with no water? While you were away, I scouted it out a bit. As you might suspect, we're approaching the spring through the back door. Gil says lots of people used to live in these caves. We are real town. But then the geysers opened up and they all had to flee. Let's go! <gasps> well, the bridges are burnt now. Let's climb a bit higher to get a better look around. The cave isn't going anywhere. Some noise! What's that? Huh? Ah, Shaitan! Stupid bats! Yeah, this place is totaled. When setting out, I kind of had hopes of finding something about my people, if not my relatives. But now I find out. And it hurts. Steady, steady. Aha! Uh -huh. Right at the entrance. Get ready, Artyom. Charge the torch, check the filters and other gear. I have this feeling, a vaguely unnerving one. Well, to hell with the feelings. Here, let me give you a boost.
see a dumb thing. Oh, wait! Artyom, mask's on! <sighs> put people back into the Stone Age. Cave, paintings and all. People lived here. Everything is built up. are done for too. Now we cross the bridge and head right. Looks like we're almost out. Follow me! Passage to the spring! Let's go!
My filter's almost done for. Well, it's a crawl from here on. <sighs> Gil says the locals follow every word the oilmen say. So, let's try to do it quietly, without the unnecessary bloodshed. The slaves are innocent. Look, water. See that car? I'll move there and hide behind it. The gate is controlled from that tower. When you open it, I'll rush the car through and you leap atop the tank. Good luck, and try not to kill anyone but the oilmen, all right? anything from guarding this place, safe for trouble. I not tell anyone I saw you. Not tell. I say truth. I not tell anyone. I spit at the doors.
Commandos, work fast, Mercer said work fast, bitches! already let's find him before he escapes
like that's all of them. Artyom, you open the gate and I'll bring the car in. Yeah, so much for stealth. At least they could. Yeah, it's not quite what I had imagined. <laughs> I don't really know what I hoped for when we left Moscow. The same we go, it's the same. Yeah. War is the same anywhere, and this place is no exception. What, what do the slaves do now? Where do they go? Well, we finally lost them. Well, at least we didn't hurt the slaves. <sighs> Looks like they aren't giving chase. Time to get back to the war. 